This is Merrin. She fell in love with James. I'm a masculine presenting woman. And I am a feminine presenting straight man. I guess people perceive us as weird as a couple because we don't follow the regular status quo. And we don't look like how they want us to look. The couple met through TikTok. And despite not being each other's usual type, I was identifying as gay because it was easier than explaining all the ins and outs of who I was. I've only dated girls in the past. The most frequent question we get is, who is the woman? Or like, who is the girl? <laughs> who is the boy? Who is and the man? Hi. I miss you. I miss you. How was your flight? Fine. Hi, I'm Marin, and this is my boyfriend James. I'm a masculine presenting woman. And I am a feminine presenting straight man. Marin and James met online after a chance comment from Marin on TikTok sparked a conversation between the pair. I just was posting different pictures of myself, like dress femme, dress mask, and I had commented on this other masculine girl's TikTok who was talking about how she thought that femme men were cute. And I was like, oh my God, girl, you're talking about me, honey. And then I saw his comment under that video. That's how I got to his profile. And then I saw his videos and I was like, I'll just flirt with him just for fun. But I was also thinking in my head, like, this is just gonna be a fun little thing that happens for a couple days and then it'll be over with. Mm -hmm. I never thought that it would be I a real thing. thing. With a connection this strong, Marin and James were keen to meet. And even after their first date, this couple knew their relationship was going to be something special, despite not being each other's usual type. Give me a high five. Yeah. He likes to make the joke that I came out the womb masculine because... Honey was wearing boy clothes in elementary school. So I've only, I've only dated girls in the past. I'm very much attracted to femininity as a whole. I love that just his energy is very feminine. Like sometimes he'll like, like this is not, the little Jack is not feminine, but the way he's acting is feminine. I just... <laughs> My sexuality was all over the place, very much. In high school, I was like this full straight, like almost hyper-masculine version of myself where like I was still one of the girls. However, I was pulling girls. And then I got to college and I was like, yeah, that ain't it, <laughs> not for me. So I was identifying as gay because it was easier than explaining all the ins and outs of who I was. Like never really just jumped all in with a man. I, I never had any interest in doing that. So when the world went on shutdown in 2020, I was on TikTok constantly like everybody was. And I was like, oh my God, these TikTok lesbians are so fine. <laughs> so that's like the first time I was exposed to like masculinity through a woman. Now, Merrin and James have been dating long distance for over a year. Oh, Merrin does the cooking. Yes, I have cooked. One time. I cooked for Valentine's Day. Yes. And it was bomb. Sometimes I come on a Saturday and I'll leave on a Monday. So I'm here for a good little minute. I guess people perceive us as weird as a couple because we don't follow the regular status quo. And we don't look like how they want us to look or how they would expect us to look. Mm. You were hungry. I'm still on it. Nothing is ever truly yours. I'm glad that we're eating now because I feel like we would have had to wait a long time at Nice Guys. Now I say, I have a girlfriend. That's the end of that's the end of the, the that's the response. I have a girlfriend. So why do you dress the way that you do? Because I like it. I like to be cute. Period. Made the first TikTok August 6th of 2021 in Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. So I like made, I posted all these pictures of us together. And I woke up the next morning and we had over a million views. And I said, babe, this is not happening. I think people saw in the video that I had on stilettos and she looked like a boy. In the beginning, people would say like, they're just best friends. They're doing this oh, for yeah. views. The most frequent question we get is, who is the woman? Or like, who is the girl? <laughs> who is the boy? Who is and the man? It was so frequent 
we were like, how stupid would that be if we made a YouTube video with the title, Who's the Woman? Who is the woman? <laughs> She identifies as a woman, I identify as a man. The Reach. only thing different is our presentation. My name has like 40,000 40, views. 40,000 views. <laughs> I don't, I want to wear my white heels. Okay. Should I do that one or should I do this one? I like this little tiny one. It's literally, it's very much like a mix of masculine and feminine. Because like, I don't like to wear dresses and like that, but I love a flowing garment, honey. Like a long flowing garment, it's gonna get me every time. But at the same time, I'm not gonna put on a ball gown. No, that's not me. Marin likes to match me. I, I did. <laughs> Marin, Marin will, Marin, Marin will inadvertently watch me get dressed first, just so she can see what I'm gonna put on so she can match me without asking. That style's very like streetwear, yeah, for sure. Like I'll have on a stiletto and she wants to wear Jordans every time. There is no big hoopla around our relationship. We are really just two people that dress differently, but the rest of our relationship is the same. And I feel like, cause none of our friends like ever felt like the way people are commenting on our TikToks. They're like, it's so regular, like it's so normal, which it is. We just dress differently. <laughs> I don't mind our relationship being public just because I feel like we get, I like being recognized in public, it's fun. I mean, we really only show what we want. Yeah. Like, they don't see the entirety of our relationship. I don't know if it will be hate at this point. Yeah. More just like jokes and curiosity. It's not like, F you, you don't deserve to be alive. No, right. we don't get that. Yeah, I knew about their relationship, um, seeing on TikTok, I mean, everybody did. I think Marin and James's relationship works because they have really open communication. I feel like if either of them have an issue, they're just very open and can talk to each other about it. Yeah, I feel like since seeing this relationship and being friends with Marin, it just makes me realize that, like, I feel like people can be made for each other, you know? Being in this relationship has taught me that there's a wide spectrum when it comes to like sexuality and all that it encompasses. It's not just a straight gay bye. Honey, it's so much more. Honestly, I think this relationship taught me that there was a lot more fluidity to me than I thought. To anyone who is judgmental of us or doesn't approve, I really don't care. You're um, paying a bill. You're paying my light bill. <laughs> I and I'm cashing the check. And I'm laughing at your comment anyways because either it was funny or it was dumb enough to where it wasn't funny. And I'm still laughing, so yeah. Love that for you. <laughs> <laughs>